Hello again, thank you for clicking through to this video where I'll just want to expel any myths about which way around the gasket and diaphragm goes both on this side of the carburetor which is the fuel pump side and this side of the carburetor which is the metering side. So if we start with the fuel pump diaphragm side, so we'll take this off, we can see straight away there that the gasket is on the lid and that the diaphragm is here on the carburetor body. This is the correct way it goes around here on the fuel pump side because we've got the little valve flaps there if we see there's one there and one there and those little valve flaps have to interact with these little fuel holes here so they need this flat surface if we were to put that gasket on first then these valve flaps wouldn't seal on that surface and interact properly so that's the way it goes we've got diaphragm gasket on this side. Turning it over onto the metering side, if we take this off here, the opposite way around. We always put the gasket on first on the metering side to allow a good spacing between this part of the diaphragm here and the back of the metering needle there. Putting this gasket on first allows a decent spacing when them two are together like that. Okay, that was just a quick tip. I hope that's helped. Thank you very much.